Well, again, here we go. Back again for another, of course, mini epic unboxing. You beauty. Okay, off we go. Have a drink. Cheers. Okay, here we go. We're going to open this up. Who's coming? Brown box, as you expect. Put it in there. Paper in the box. Paper out. Looks pretty good. And as you can see, two Planet of the Apes. A um, face hugger. There you go. And we're off and running. So thanks again for watching and watching all this time. The uh, first one we got is, I believe this is um, Cornelius's. I don't know if it's his mum or he. I can't remember if it's his mum or if. Uh, Zara, or if it's his um, missus, his girlfriend, I just can't, you know, I just can't remember. No, I think that might have been girlfriend, boyfriend, hooking it up, and then they had the, yeah, a bit lost here, let me know. You see, nice cover on the box. I don't know how it is, it might be a bit reflective there side like i said you can keep them in the box this is number two from ages 14 and up so the box has come apart a little bit there a little bit here but that's a bit of one bit of super glue super glue that's back there you go everything so let's get the old trusty knife out and give it a whirl it's still not trying to damage a box like you know like the box is still pretty good it's just a bit of glue's come come undone put a bit of tape on that so i can just cut the box myself you lunatic okay so i'm gonna take this out here glasses off for a minute and this one here is pretty sure not huge little like um, I, mean, I think 30 centimeters is like the tallest like mini epic you get and that's smart i think they're again him i'm not sure you know like he's a, he's quite a bit extra than what i paid for these i think this is like ten dollars or something like that which is a bloody good deal here you go let's open there put the glasses on so i can open this up anybody getting anything good lately I've got a couple of things you know but i thought just a mini mini epics and stuff Got his stand. Pretty good. Planet of the Apes. I think it looks like the same as the other. Yeah. Same as the other ones. Nothing. Nothing spectacular. It still looks pretty nice. Um, there you go. Pretty good. And they brought out um whether every so often has little like if you subscribe to their like newsletter and all this stuff and I from them and they do little mini epics but like different artists will get it and do a different take on it and make them I think they might, might have brought out three or something now and they look tremendous. Like just and somebody just wins it and they send it off to them and there you go. Have a one one of course which would be good. But some of them it's kind of like bring these out you know they look like really spectacular just a bit di bit different take on some of these so hopefully when i looked at um like minister if they're bringing that out because it was back out because it was an open edition wasn't limited edition so they're not um would you say going okay they limited something to like 2,000 pieces and then they decide to reissue it or reissue it in a different colour or whatever. Uh, I haven't had any of that, but if it's something just open edition means you buy it and they can make 20 or they can make 20 billion, you know? And a lot of times it's 
nice to have a number where it's not a huge big number, but at the end of the day, if everybody can get what they want, well, there you go. Don't have to pay an extra, extravagant price for it. Like on the second hand market, you know. I try to get things at a deal, some things I am paying off at the moment. But you don't want to. So she's pretty. She's pretty good. You know, bring it up here, have a look at the. See what you think. I think she looks quite. It's pretty well done. The paint job's really well done. Holes in the feet, you know, stuff like that. It's a nice. Back is got a booty there. The hair's nicely sculpted. It's a simple, and she's um. I think she's like a doctor or a scientist or something like that in the movie. Yeah, put it on the stand. How does she stand? Pretty good too. But you know, maybe if you don't want the stands, like I said, I like to have it because a bit more support. Um, so they don't fall over and fall on maybe some of your other stuff. She's pretty good. I like her. Yeah. Nice indeed. Nice little piece. Buying some stuff down. She might be doing, um, what do you call it, getting the grocery list and getting the, you know, getting stuff ready for the dinner. You know? Straight in the kitchen, not my lovely. <laughs> That's what I like. Okay, I'm gonna put her over there. Put that there, it goes with that. And we're gonna pull out another one. Ta -da. Of course, I already knew which one I was grabbing. This one here, Planet of the Apes, the old Doc. Here he is. What's he number? He's number one, so the Doctor was number one. Doctors aren't always number one, you know? But I don't know if he was a Doctor of Medicine or just a Doctor of, um, yeah, you know, some people like your yeah, MD, and then you can be a doctor of like um, um, you know, the mental stuff, um, psychologist, all that kind of like made up dribble that people earn a crap load of money for. But here you go, the box is pretty nice. Picture, like I said, picture of him on the the top, on the back. I don't think they built any more than these three out. I don't know if they sold well or they didn't sell well. They got a good price, so as far as I'm concerned, it was the bottom's got nothing spectacular on it. And number one, so let's get the old this blade out here. Let's just scroll it just nicely, that's good. Then there's a box, and this box is in pretty good order. Okay, we're going to take him out. Okay, he's out. Like you see, they're packaged really well. Like they're packaged well. They're right up there. I'll just take your stand out. I'm not going to pull the book out because it's exactly the same as the rest. What else have we got here? Uh, over in the States, I think it's uh, winter over there, a bit chilly, you know. Wish it was winter here. Fucking right in there. It's like, I think 30, it's like 32 or 34 degrees. Sunday is going to be like 30, 36. And the humidity is horrendous. It's just like, unbelievable. Good day to have some ice cream. Ice cream is something nice. Wheat. Wheat ice creams are the best. So the absolute got uh, Fruto, the original one was good, but I have all different flavours now, but Wheat had one tonight actually with macadamia nuts. Oh my god. The single best ice cream you get in the world. It's okay, that's that one over there. That's that one there. Let's have a look. Okay, he's got a walking. He's um, get up here. Look at that. He does look pretty good. 
Got a good face. He looks like he's thinking about a lot of things. His jacket's very nice. Nice colour. Beautiful. Okay. And he's got his hand behind his back here. Probably, you know, you know, planning up some monkey shit and stuff like that, you know, like thinking, oh, what, what dodgy stuff he's going to do. It's quite, well, can see a bit old. Walking six a bit like the old, um, not exactly the same thing, get carried away. Kind of like the Emperor from the old Star Wars. But yeah, I think he's pretty good. Good, um, I'll just say, uh, I think the paint job's like, on all of these, it's like really good, and then you'll get a statue or something that's worth a lot, lot more money, and they'll go over somewhere or something like this, but this is. Tremendous. Okay, get him. How does he stand? That's pretty good. Let's get him next to our soft drink. They're all about the same height. So, yeah, there you go. Can of soft drink. Not going to take up much space. There. I'm pretty laid back on that. Okay, quiet well, things. And trying to add a few videos together, like maybe do some kind of editing thing, but. See how it goes. Okay, he's on there. There you go. Pretty good. I think he's pretty good. Yeah, I'm actually next to um then they worked in the same like um area in the movie together, you know? Like he was uh the man, the man who knows more. Yeah, there you go, have a look at that. I think I think they're pretty good. Pretty nice, simple, yeah. and one of my mates, he he loves it. He just he just looks at it and goes, "She reminds me of something special." <laughs> okay, and the last one out of this box is this one here. There's a course mini epic number three alien. Face hugger, and that um, on the top, nice cover. It's a nice box. It's green. Number three. Number. If you look on the back, number one was the xenomorph. Three. Side of the box. Face hugger. This one here. It's pretty. It, it's pretty, I think you'd have to have like, because they're kind of pretty dark inside there, pretty good light to see inside. So yeah, I, I think these here, personally, I think these should come out, chuck them on your shelf, have a bit of a look. Of course, they've got some stranger, they've got stranger things out as well that they do in this, but they're the kind of uh, top end of the like, money line sort at the moment. Maybe if they come down, I might get uh, somebody that I know that likes that. But at the moment, they're just a little bit too expensive. This is a very big base. I hope that's not reflecting too much. So, and uh, what's a book like? Crack them all. I don't crack them all. But yeah, that's, um, that's um. Oh, uh, uh, Alan Ripley. Is there's one of her as well down there? Have a look at that. Not too bad. Nice. Look, all these books like they used to always. What you know, when you'd go to weather, they'd come over. You'd buy something off them, or you'd get them. Um, go to Supernova when they used to go into Brisbane at Supernova. Please come back. Come on now. And you know they'd have their books where they'd have everything in it. What's coming out for the year? What's out? You'd be able to look, see what you had, see what you missed. That was um, pretty good. Okay, so we're going to take this out and get a hold of it. Oh, that's right there. Uh, there you go. The box is yeah, pretty good. Basically, the um, face huggers, what they would do is just suck onto your face 
and put their little baby inside of you, you know, and then they just break out of your chest and come to life and stuff like this, you know, so not the best way to go, but you know, not necessarily the worst. If you become an alien, it'd be a lot, but not if you're just brown bread. I think this is pretty good, this one. Really, really nice. Okay, I'm going to have to bring this. Oh, stands pretty good as well. So there you go. Not go too bad. A little standing, you know, because some things you get and you try to stand them and they're all over the shop. Let's have a look at this. What's this like? Well, that looks pretty good. I don't know how well it's going to... Okay, we'll start with the boots first. Great. Really nice shoes. Bam, look at that. Nice paintwork. His pants are done really well. But the painting's really good. It's a bit kind of dirty and scruffy because he would be, like, fighting. It's a he or she in there. I can't... I think it's a dude. Yeah. On the back, that's pretty good. Got his breathing apparatus, but that's going to help not having crap at the base hugger gets in there. Coming out of his chest like nothing. Okay, and look at the back of his helmet. That's pretty nice. Pretty good detail. Like in the little toys and that you get, get good, good, nice detail. On there, he's got a, he's got a hole of it in his hand. I don't know how well you can see in there. Hopefully you can see that. And he's screaming because he knows he's in a bit of trouble. The face hugger. I don't think I'm really going to be able to see it on here, but hopefully I can get it in a bit. It is like, when you look at it in the bit that's sucking on your face, it's basically like a vagina. So that's what it is. You get the, you can get one of big ones and they, like, like these, that's the face hugger there. He's just like a human alien dude. And just like, imagine like a vagina just straight on your face. And it's basically sucking the life out of you. So that's what that, um... That is, that's what basically, where they must have come up with the idea from it for the face hugger. Straight on, straight on the vagina. And you get on that and it's, here you go. Straight out of there. Remember I didn't say any swear words or anything. Good on, no, good on you YouTube, yeah. Give me a bit of pleasure and some fun to do and I get to meet other people and talk to other people. But yeah, basically it just looks like a, I think it looks like a vagina. Not, not the, the outside here, like the bit in there, like, you know. So I'm just going to put this. Give me a second. Just put this foot on here. And on here. That's a bit more difficult to get on this one. But, but you will get used to it. It's like... Might have said on the wrong bloody one. No, it should have been right. Ah, uh, yes, I did. Had it around the wrong way, see? And that there is the alien and the face. Well, not the alien, like, well, no, he's alien. Face huggers on the human. And, yeah, pretty scared in there. Looks like. Not going to be having a good time. Next to a can of drink. There we go. So, I really probably, what I say out of all of them, what I like the best. We've really got the alien there. We've got the old teacher here. Teacher, whatever, the Planet of the Apes dude. The other, the doc there, Doctor, Doctor Who is the best doctor, you got to admit that, the Doctor Doolittle, you've got the um, predators at the back here, so they seem a little bit higher, which is pretty nice, I think that predator there, which I did my other one as well, like him there, like, that looks like a vagina too, you know, you have a good look. But look at that, right in there. There you go, that looks pretty good. Or maybe it's that way, I'm not sure. We'll have to check that out. But definitely the face hugger definitely does. He goes, he goes there. Beautiful. 
I got them and from the ones before the good old move this back a little bit put the bottom air there and the old little the little fella making a paper plane probably makes some mischief put in there so there you go that's what I got in like I said I did a few videos let's see on the other side see how that looks that looks pretty good looks look pretty nice indeed um, what is the one I like the best? Probably, hmm. I like this one the best. The alien with the face hugger. Ah, uh, what do you say? Love vaginas. Okay, so we've got them all here on the stand. All the ones that I just got here. And we've got Boromir, uh, Cornelius, the Doc. Um, Zara, I forget her name. Alien face hugger. Um, the predator with the mask. And the predator without the mask. There's a pretty good deal. I'm pretty happy. It looks really good. Probably this predator here. Pre predator. Alien face hugger. Yeah, that's kind of that one there. Or the predator at the back. Look the best. Yeah really nice that's great see and they don't they don't take up a lot, lot of room not enjoyable hope you like this hope you get some have a good day okay i've got some different stuff i've got some bigger stuff coming as well i've got some hot toys i'm going to really do a review on i've got some of my older stuff that i'm going to do a review so i can put them away and put out some new stuff so thanks once again for watching mr diggles shoot us a like hit a subscribe thank you very much